Hey coaches, Allison Anderson here. And today I wanna to talk to you about using events on Facebook for your free challenge groups. Every month we should be offering um, customers, challengers, people out there, um, free content. That's how you're gonna bring quality to their lives. Um, it makes you seem more legit, like you know what you're talking about. Um, everyone likes getting something free, so that's gonna get them following you. And as coaches, we, we genuinely should want to help people and provide content and help them live a better life. So this, these free groups do that for us. Um, what else they do is they give people a little um, sneak peek into what a big challenge group could be. So you're, um, they're gonna complete a three or five day free challenge and get that confidence built up that they can do that and they're, um, they're maybe more likely to join your, your longer 21 day group. So, but that just takes follow up and you connecting with them and providing them with that support and information. So, um, what we want to do with these events is you create an event. Every time you do a free group, it's a new event. Okay? So, if I'm doing one a month, on the first of every month, I'm going to have a new event every month. Right? And you invite people to it. Um, when you have a free group, the group you create does not change. Okay, you don't create a new group every time, um, just a new event, okay, and you invite people to it. In that event page, um, I'll invite, invite everybody, I'll do a post about it, and then about a week building up to that, I post daily, okay? And then three days before, I'll post a link to that group. So if they wanna join, they have to click the link and get moved to the group, okay? And then all the contents in that group page, not in the event page. So when you create a new event, you add, a, add people and then they accept into that one. But all these people are getting put into the same group page. So ideally, six months from now, if you add 10 people a month, you're gonna have 60 people in that group still getting that content, okay? So in a year, you may have 120 people. Um, and so they're gonna be getting that exposure to your support, your groups, um, you, they're gonna trust you as a good resource of how to change their health and fitness, or if the free groups aren't about health and fitness, which is great and I recommend, they're gonna see that you're willing to offer them a lot of free resources and support in a lot of areas um, with no concern about a paycheck, okay? Because it's a free group. So utilize that, it's a great um, tool, a good strategy. I've had success. I know a bunch of other coaches who um, have had success doing that event route. So I just wanna walk you through it. If you have any questions, please comment, like, post below. I'm gonna post this video on my YouTube channel as well, Allison Page Health and Wellness. So let me know if you have any thoughts or questions or other ideas. Talk to y'all soon, bye.